these are the best ways to get combat XP in Stranded, and yeah. So, there's multiple ways. I'm going to split this video into two parts. It's still going to be relatively short, but anyways. One, the first part is Slayers, and the second part is Minions. First of all, Slayers can get you a lot of combat XP, but they cost money, so they can be pretty expensive. So, first of all, there's Rev Slayer. The Revenant Slayer is the Zombie Slayer, and if you can get to the combo level, I think 25 is required, you can do Tier 5s, and Tier 5s can get you a lot of combat XP an hour. A lot of it is the mini bosses, because with mini bosses, they can drop like 2000 XP per mini boss, and you can spawn a lot of them really quickly, and the boss itself gets about 4000 XP. And so per boss you kill, you get around 10,000 XP. The rates mainly depend on your minion tier and speed. So if you have tier 9 zombie minions, that is a lot better than tier 7. And also, make sure you're putting sea lantern nets in them because the lapis zombies give more XP than regular zombies. So the more minions you have, and the higher tier they are, the more XP you get an hour. I have 25 tier 7s and I can easily get above 1 million XP an hour. So if you have more than 25 and they're above tier 7, I'm sure you can get a lot more. The second slayer is Tarantula, and that is the Spider Slayer. So that once again, mainly depends on your minion, speed, and tier. So I think I have full tier seven or nine, and I use a wolf pet, but a Tarantula pet is a lot better. It gives you a lot more combat wisdom against spiders. So with that, it's basically the same concept as Revs, but you can put minion expanders in them to make it faster and you can also put fly catchers if you have those but i doubt anybody has those with my setup i can easily get like over 500 or 600 000 xp an hour it's pretty good and it's cheaper than revs wolf is not very good for xp and i don't know much about enderman or blaze as i haven't really done them yet but i've heard that if you kill a tier 3 enderman you can kill tier 4 mini bosses for enderman and get a lot of xp an hour but i'm just going to briefly put that there as apparently it's cheaper and more money efficient but i haven't tested it myself so i don't know anyways for slayers that's about it the main thing you want to do is just try to get a wolf pet but it's not that important that you don't have a wolf pet the main thing is your minion tier and amount the second part is minion there's two minions i'm going to go over first is gas minions gas minions if you place down a lot then it can be decent for xp but not as good as Slayers, but it's kind of semi-AFK. You can't really like hold down right click with a frozen scythe. I think you have to be constantly like right clicking different times or left clicking or whatever, but you don't really have to move around that much. You can just move your mouse and click every so often. And guests give you around 100 XP per. If you have champion, you can get a little bit more. And the main thing that it depends on is how many minions you have and what tier they are. So with Around 25 tier 5 minions, I was getting around 400,000 XP an hour. But if you had full tier 7, 9, or 11, and you had like 29 of them, I'm sure you could get upwards of 600,000 XP an hour, basically making a profit for free. So that's one thing it has on Slayers as well, is it's free, and it's a lot easier to do, and you can get over 500k XP an hour from it, which is pretty good. The second minion is one that you just have to collect, and that is Zealot Minion. Zealot minions can get you actually a lot of XP an hour. I don't remember the specific amounts, but I think with 28 tier 11, it was around like 500k XP a day with catal hyper catalysts. So I'm sure if you have less minions or less tiers and you only use foul flesh or you just use plasma buckets, you can still get easily over 100,000 combat XP a day. And that basically means you don't even have to play the game to get a lot of combat XP. Although, I'm sure the rates are a bit worse because Special Zealot Loot is not a thing right now as it's broken or the admins disabled it or something like that. But that's how you get it without even playing the game and it's pretty good. Anyways, let me know if I missed any in the comments and I'll just let you guys know. But once again, Revs can get you 1 mil XP an hour, Tarantula and Ghasts can get you around 500 to 600k XP an hour, and your main apparently is like that good or better but i'm not really sure as i haven't tested it myself and zell minions can get you a pretty decent chunk without even playing the game 